Oh my god! Hello everybody, I'm Catman Chief. Welcome to FNAF, FNAF, FNAF World. Today, an RPG game based around FNAF characters. And we are going to be playing today, and ignore that save file, that's just my save file, because I was checking out the game. And we're going to play a new game, and sure, let's erase the data that isn't there. But we are going to play on the more difficult one, on normal mode. Now, we get to choose from these characters, and I've only played as these five, Freddy and Foxy. So, we gotta be careful with what we're choosing here. Now, I know that Freddy and Foxy and Bonnie, kind of, are, like, kind of damage characters. I don't know what the deal with Freddy is, but I think he's kind of a tank, I don't know. But uh, Toy Freddy had a healing and one of the good moves, so I'm gonna put him on my team. And I just want to put Balloon Boy on my team just because. You know, why don't why don't we give that to Balloon Boy? Then let's have Barney and Chica for our second team. We'll have regular Freddy, regular Balloon Boy, uh, Mangle, and Toy Bonnie. All right, let's try this out. Let's try this out. Oh my God! I feel like I'm going on a show. I'm going to say it's going to be really, very long. Oh, it's not well in animatronica. Animatronic village? Village tronica? We're working on it. The point is that something is horribly, horribly wrong. There have been a lot of bizarre creatures roaming around lately. Even some that look like us. We are prepared to deal with situations like this. Something bad must have happened on the flip side. Go, go see what you can find. Be careful, though. Our wood-cutting auto chipper has gone haywire. It's been drum scaring me all day. Yeah, yeah. The boss kind of has a move called jump scare. Oh, but you don't really believe that, do you? Um, kind of did. There's a task for you to complete. You have to leave Greg Crumbs for him help to help him find his way. Virtue Freddy, blink and you'll miss him. Huh. Alright, I believe. Cupcake. Toxic balloon! Boom. See? Just like that. Dead. Freaking dead. So I know. I know that you have to collect clocks in this game. Sky really quick. Uh, regen. Toxic balloon. Lucky. Dead. Boom. Like that. It's dead. Um, yeah, there's one down this way. Oh, sorry, not down that way. Um, down. Up. Up and to the right. You know, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. So, I'm gonna tell- I'm gonna be straight with you on this one. This is going to require a lot of farming, and I might not always get back to it right away. So, yeah, you guys know. Boom. That's a balloon. I beat Dead. Boom. Just like that. Level up! Woohoo! Let's go, I go this way. I be Action Balloon. My gosh. Good gen song. Yay! Yeah, there's a clock up this way. No? I thought there was a clock over here. It's like a clock. Whoa! Yeah, I'm not using Freddy's good move. Let's try out the other thing. Oh, I didn't even keep going for it. Whoa! 
on this way. To be honest, I think I forgot where it is. Or maybe... Yeah, it's supposed to be right there. Okay, maybe it just appears. Maybe it appears. Can't get through there without a key. Okay, so this is the auto chipper. We're gonna fight it. Got a new chip, and the chips, I don't exactly know what they do yet, but we'll we'll figure it out on our own time. And got another box over here, and another chip, head start defense. Yeah, start battle with a temper. Oh, okay, so that's what those, okay, okay. So I was playing earlier, and yeah, there were arrows by my characters, and I was like, what does that mean? See, see, see that there? Oh. Yeah, and apparently, uh, stop! Cause you know, gotta get to the plate. Do, 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 do. I'm actually digging this ambient music. Okay, yeah, gotta go. Alright, this way. Why, but I always happen to fight one of these, and once I get to that point, it's just completely OP party that can totally beat one of those. Okay, yeah, so that's where the chipper was. So, I don't know, maybe I go this way? Because I already talked to Golden Freddy for the second time in my other playthrough. I mean, like that toxic balloon. Got Dead. That's what I call killing it. So I haven't not haven't bought a bite yet. Okay. So we want to get we want to get that thing. We want to get that thing over there, down there. Oh my god, fast, bow, whatever. Yeah, but we want to get that thing down there. We don't want to get them fish. We want to get a... We want to get that pearl. And, and we'll get it by itself eventually. Get it by itself. Come on. We're out of time here. Ha! Got it. Boom. Jamming. That mouth though. Yeah, I got, got some. Gonna get the neon wasp. Which really helps. To be honest, really helps. I'm not buying from that guy. It's just incredibly hard again. Dead. Just killing it. I found a clue to what is happening. 
look behind me! There is a tree that is distorted and glitched! Aha! Freaky Mouse! Golden Freddy! Aha! You don't know as much as I do, but I will tell you this is a safe haven, a sanctuary! Whatever has gone wrong, we have to fix it! It will be an adventure! Something horrible must have happened on the flip side, because if it's causing this world to fracture, objects like the tree behind me have broken. But I think that you can use these fractures to, go to get to places you couldn't reach before. You have to go and find the source of these fractures. Uh, there, I gotta wait. Cause that's that's how I got the guy last time. Yeah. Yes, the world beneath this surface world. Okay. This is a sick place, a sanctuary. The truth is that there is no safe place. You don't understand that. You are made for one thing. There is a task for you to complete before you follow this passage. Go back. Find the clock. Like that clock? Click on it. I'm just kidding. I know exactly where the clock is. So yeah, I'm not going to go on the tree yet. But what I am going to do... Is go back. Sure, I was going over before to find the clock. Yep, there it is. Yep, told you. Told you it was right there. Okay, and then there's this weird mini game thing. For some reason, I just have a giant tongue sticking out. Yep, that is just done. Done just like that. Going to that tree. What? And now I'm here. Oh. That I be attack and freaking pizza wheel. Oh, yeah, see, that's Fast Bear Hills. And then there's Choppy Woods over here. So far, yeah, no belief except for maybe I beam. I beam is pretty good, but yeah, I guess into the tree again. Richard Freddy. Blink and you'll miss him. Let's let's check on the Camtasia recording, shall we? Okay, 14 minutes in. Pizza wheel. Toxic balloon. Cupcake. Yeah, cause you know. Can't have too much. Be sure to press that button behind you to clear the path for later, that way you won't have to take the long way again. I think that a lot of these monsters are misguided side effects of whatever has happened on the flip side. It looks like you can knock some sense into them and they'll join you. How wonderfully convenient. We need to find another subtunnel under the game. 
It's and it's probably hidden beneath another glitched object. Ahead are the dusting fields. You'll probably find the next glitched object there. Be careful, things only get more dangerous from here. And then um speak nose. Things don't get more dangerous. You are being played. You are being lotted through hoops. Meanwhile, the puppet master is laughing at you. You don't need to. You do need to find the dusting fields, but make sure. But not because there is any urgent adventure ahead. Find the clock. What are these clocks? What What are these clocks for? Am I being played by him? Huh. Huh. Interesting. It's real. Got, give me some fast tokens. There's a duck. Okay. metal men in the cave they were not as easy to kill as you I will say that because you know you can never have enough fast tokens. Uh, you're doing really good. Well, it seems like there's another boss over there. Oh. Another auto trooper. Holy jeez. by a pipe. Not as hard as I thought it would be. Cause that's how it's done. Ever comment weak. Comments may occasionally fall. Okay. Seems seems kind of normal, I guess. Well, maybe I missed a lot of that stuff back here. Cause there were a lot of chests that were like impossible to go to. Uh, well, I don't know why I was about to quick switch, but yeah. Glad that that cut me off. Yeah. Yeah, party can't be changed once you're created.
Oh, I got that. Okay, Chica leveled up. Art is pretty powerful. The more, the more the merrier. Good point, Nightmare Freddy. There's gotta be some way to get over there. I mean, it can't be impossible. Like, there's a map, right? Oh, yeah, a tab. Maybe those two caves are connected? What's that? Coming. Hey, what? What? The, how? It's the question. To how or to not how? Oh yeah. Yeah. I was about to say yeah. Like that's gonna be hard. There's a giant chest. See, I don't get it. I guess there's some kind of thing that off. Yeah, thanks, chopping rolls. It really cheered me up. Confused, like, how does the That's gonna kill it. It's me. See, like that.
I like to get as much as much uses as abilities as possible. Calling me a watermelon! The jokes, Scott. The jokes. Oh. I wanna get this one. Yeah. Cut! Because look at him! Look at him! He's so cool! Alright. Hey, let's get, find a good place to stop. The sub tunnel must be up ahead. However, it looks like something is blocking its path. I'm sure it's nothing you can't handle. I do need to warn you of something, though. When you enter a glitched object into a sub tunnel, it's possible to find yet another glitched object inside. That sub that will take you into a sub tunnel beneath the sub tunnel. There may be even more glitched objects there. Just make sure. Just be sure to never go more than three glitches down. I'm not sure if you would find your way back up. Be sure to always search for new chips and bites. It will be a huge help against the monsters like the one up ahead. And play along for now. You are being pulled on a string for his amusement. Whose amusement? Don't enter the glitch yet. You need to. You need to go into the mine. Find the clock. Withered Freddy, because we need one more. Okay, we need to find the clock in the mine. So I need to enter the mine. To be honest, this seems a little bit easy. I hope hard mode is like actually hard. Enter that glitch. Well, no, I don't need to enter a glitch yet. I need to enter the mine, which is up exactly where I was gonna go. Yeah. Simple as that. Simple fighting, you know? There is stuff going on all over the place because it's real time combat. But, yeah. Okay. Save. Got all of our bites. Let's party. True, true, true. Let's party. See. Um, we got all our chips attached. Yep. Out of order since FNAF 1, which doesn't make any sense because FNAF 4 took place before FNAF 1's got. Have you been doing homework on your own games? Alright. Oh. Oh, 
don't know, but this might be a little bit more easy than we thought it was going to be. Oh. Oh, well. Let's yet enter the mine. What? On the clock. That was pretty simple. Okay, so I am correct. I is the third one. I'm just hoping that there isn't another clock in here. So that's the entrance. Alright, so I can get over there. So... be hard. beam finishing it off as always but I should probably end this episode oh oh I'm dead. There you go. Oh! I can stun him! I can stun him! I can stun him! Oh. Game over. Everybody, seems like a good place to leave off. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. And, Chief out.